The ocean gives us life. It feeds us, entertains us, connects us, inspires us and powers our success. I grew up in a beachside suburb of Sydney and it was very often the case that I'd head down to the beach after school with my mates. It is so much part of our way of life. From an early age, uh, you learn how to swim, you learn how to fish. That's a very important part of our culture and tradition. Indigenous peoples have lived in harmony with our natural world and our oceans for millennia, and we need to draw from their expertise on how to better support and cherish and steward our oceans. We are sailors, we are fishermen, we are industrialists. We are dependent on the oceans. But today, the ocean's health is off track. At a time when we are already looking to recover from the unprecedented COVID-19 pandemic, we understand how vulnerable we are to health and other shocks. It's important that we consider ocean as a partner. Life on Earth as we know it depends on the health of the ocean. Research shows that a healthier ocean is a smart investment that will deliver social, health and economic and environmental benefits. The health of our Earth and the health of our people are linked. They're totally intertwined. Nuestra visión es encontrar un balance entre la conservación y el uso sustentable de los recursos del mar. I believe we can choose a triple win, a win for people, a win for nature and our economy. We effective protection, sustainable production and equitable prosperity go hand in hand. The Ocean Panel, composed of 14 serving world leaders, has put forward a new ocean action agenda. We invite to assure a gestion durable of 100% of the zones oceanic that are located in the of our territory. Listening to science, listening to research, listening to best practices that we have seen work for many other countries. Sustainable ocean action should be a cornerstone of national and global policies. Pengelolaan laut yang berkelanjutan akan mendukung pencapaian SDGs. We are looking for reason to believe that in 2021 and beyond, we can not only fix what COVID did to the world, but also fix the problems we already had on our plate. Climate change, pollution, ecosystem collapse, economic instability, unhealthy diets, poverty, and unsustainable practices across all sectors. The answer is a healthy ocean with sustainability at its core. Oceans may separate us physically, but they can also bring humanity together for a healthy, prosperous future. El esfuerzo por una economía oceánica sostenible y sustentable tiene que ser multisectorial y multilateral. We call on more world leaders and other partners to join us in turning the 100% goal into reality and treat the oceans as the solutions for the future. The ocean gives us so much, let's give it 100%.